Boy Erased, Joel Edgerton's second foray into directing after the unusually intelligent suspense movie The Gift, is the second film this year to deal with the subject of conversion therapy, the method by which religious organisations attempt to reprogram gay children. Edgerton's fine, subtle movie involves a teenage youth whose parents enrol him against his will into a facility where they are confident his attraction to members of his own sex can be cured. Set in provincial Arkansas, the film centres on Jared, played by Lucas Hedges, the fine young actor from Manchester by the Sea. He's the son of Marshall, Russell Crowe, a Baptist clergyman, and Nancy, Nicole Kidman, who shares her husband's devotion. Marshall confronts Jared with this revelation and then packs him off to a conversion camp run by Victor Sykes, Joel Edgerton, who lacks any psychiatric or medical qualifications for his position. Sykes staff include men who have, they claim, overcome their queer tendencies and are thus equipped to help boys like Jared do the same. The film is based on real characters and the film ends, as many real-life films do these days, with photos of the real Jared, whose actual name is Garrod Conley, and who wrote the memoir on which Edgerton's screenplay is based. It's a disturbing theme, beautifully developed by Edgerton and superbly acted by an excellent cast. Russell Crowe has rarely been better than here as the deeply religious man who loves his son but fears for him. Kidman, too, is really fine as the mother who finds herself torn between caring for her husband and yet deeply troubled about what's happening to her son. She underplays the role to perfection. Hedges depicts the pain and anguish of Jared with conviction. Boy Erased is a modest but heartfelt film, and I think an important one. I'm giving it four stars. Mm-hmm.